let's check our flowers the next day after planting oh still lovely and also the lavender it looks so alive Bloom. and this too <laughs> this one looks like dying yesterday but they're good now we picked that lavender from somewhere and we put it in the soil this one it, it opens up blooms this morning and then no, 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 no. looks like it's closing again i don't know if it wants sun or it wants rain we are on our way to the gp i'm gonna get my first dose of vaccine covid vaccine today get nervous <laughs> I'm done. Just waiting for 15 minutes. I have to stay here and wait if I'm gonna feel anything. So today is my first day since the vaccine. My first dose of Pfizer yesterday and so far I only have sore arm and that's it. No fever anything. Although sometimes a while ago I feel tired and afraid that I might be sick but now it's not. When I sit down, I'm feeling sick. But when I go up, do I move around, it's gone. So I hope it's nothing. It's the first dose, though. So I'm looking forward on the second dose. I hope I won't have fever or anything, any effect like that. But for now, it's all good with the first dose. Now, let's check my DC. Since um, I planted this one, last we planted this one last Sunday. <laughs> I keep checking on this uh every single day oh you can't see it properly here because of this we'll go outside yay it's blooming again this one actually this morning when the sun is up they are really like looking alive except the one at the bottom i think they'll survive this one i don't know what happened to this should i cut this or not looks like it's dead Venetia, but the rest are still good although it looks a little bit weak when we got this one i just bought it because i like the color and it's the only one left in her shop maybe we can rescue the others and the lavenders are looking well this one here blooming more this one i saw a butterfly here a while ago <laughs> lingering around her this one my favorite so the same looking pretty and this one survived this one was like um the other white one last time yesterday and when we planted after we planted but now look look they're surviving as well they're bloom fully bloom that's it now let's check our mailbox yay i got a uh, Loving the colors. It must be the referral from the doctor. Pathology requests. When is this? A hep B plus C. When man? Maybe. Oh, routine screening. O G T T V. But when is this? Copies to 26 to 28, maybe 26 weeks to 28. And then the other one is. I cannot read doctor's handwriting. <laughs> ah, another scan. Nine percent of this road scan is a road scan. Read it. Ah, okay. So I'll go. 28 weeks, 30 to 36, so 3 referrals for scan and then 1 for pathology because so I have a low-lying placenta now so they need to check every I have. I need to go th uh, 3 more scan to see if it moves up so just an update, I'm feeling better now when I woke up this morning which I'm glad and my arm is um, not that sore now it's better as well doesn't hurt as much as yesterday because yesterday I was like I had a sore arm which I'm not that worried because I think that's a common um, effect of the vaccine but 
midday. So afternoon, I'm feeling tired and I have a bit of um, headache, mild headache. And it gets a bit worse in the evening. So I'm feeling like quite sick, but no fever. I was, um, I keep monitoring my temperature, but it's just normal. It didn't go high, so I didn't have fever. Just um, tiredness and mild headache. So I was thinking, I hope it won't um, develop to fever. But now I sleep and then I sleep. And this morning I'm feeling better as normal. So I'm glad I'm looking forward to the second dose, I hope. It's just like this, <laughs> no adverse effect. And also the baby is still kicking away because I'm also monitoring um, his pattern of movement and it's still the same. So it's still moving and all, so all good. Happy Sunday. So we just came home from baby bunting. So we pick up the change table. Finally, I got it. It was so quick. So I ordered it online last night for click and collect and then they messaged me this morning that it's ready for collection. So I got the four baby deluxe bath changer. Um, yep, the white one. So that's yay. So I will assemble this maybe the next day now. It's a good day today, sunny, and it's a, it's been a week since we planted our flowers. So I'm gonna check them out outside. It's sunny and look who's happy. So blooming. This one. Yeah, this one is very cute. I like it. With the small ones in the background. Not bloomed yet. And this look, look who's alive and looking blooming today. So this one I've been watching this particular flower african daisy the whole week and i know her pattern now every time it's gloomy or raining it like close but when it's sunny like today it is very bloom open looks happy so she likes the sun this one the other night there's a very strong wind actually the body the eye Cut, cut. Oh, the wind tortured the flowers last time. So one of it is broke. As for this, I will need to cut this one here. I think this is what they call the dead heading. Because I think this looks dead. So I will cut them. So I haven't done this one before. It's just like just below the stem the flower and just above the healthy leaves so this one around here we'll cut it there all done and i got another letter from the mail it's from the hospital another appointment ob appointment Okay, so I think this is going to be face to face for the first time because it didn't said like telephone um, appointment. Because last time I talked with the doctor, she said that we're gonna see each other next appointment. So I think this is, I don't like face to face. So this is going to be November 16. So I will be right now, I'm 24 weeks. So 24, 5, 6, 2, 7. Eight. So I'm going to be 28 weeks, yeah, because I heard when you're 28 weeks and over, they will see you face to face. So by that time, I think I should be um, having some of my tests and scan, like the last mail that they sent. Those are like referrals for scan and um, tests that should be done between 26 to 28. So I should be doing the, this, those before 28 maybe 26 or 27 weeks before the ob appointment so she can see the result i have to start making appointment now and it's 9 30 a.m weekdays i hate so i don't like face to face because oh yeah i need to excuse from work we don't have weekend i don't think we have weekend 
that's it. By the way, I cut my hair yesterday. Yesterday? No, last Friday. Just a simple cut. The short one. <laughs> it's too long already. I like long hair, but my hair is not a lustrous, shiny, long hair. So I need to cut it. And I'm also planning to color it. I bought one from Garnier. The one with uh, ammonia-free. Olia. So maybe I'll do with that later. So that's the update for this week. I hope you enjoyed your week and see you again on the next video. Mm -hmm.